Sheets, and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke with Hubby! Hubby! Merry Christmas, you guys! Merry Christmas! <laughs> I hope you are having a wonderful Christmas surrounded by your family or friends or your fur babies. Oh, she's busy. We'll get back to her later. <laughs> she's nibbling. She's nibbling. Uh, is she? Hold my calls. <laughs> All right, guys, so before we start, I want to let you know, today is going to be a shorter episode than normal because me and hubby and fur babies want to encourage that you be with your family, so you will spend half the time watching the video that you normally would today so you can spend time with them, but please share with them because that would be cool too. <laughs> okay, so last time we got the gym badge, which was awesome. Um, let's go ahead and do a team recap. All right, so at the top, we have Duck Duck with the Naughty Nature and Water Absorb. He was awesome in the last episode. We have Dewdrop, our starter, with Oblivious and a Naughty Nature. We've got Littlefoot, Sassy Nature, and Flame Body, which is so funny. <laughs> Are there plants that get burn, that give burn effects in real life? Well, Poison Ivy. Oh, yeah, you're right about that. We have Fast Boy, <laughs> who has Forewarn and the Lax Nature. And Toots, our newest member, who's gentle natured and has Snow Cloak, which is super random, but you know what? Whatever. And then we've got Bum Bum with Leaf Guard and a relaxed nature. That is our team. That's what we're going with. But now I want to see that since we have the badge, if we can actually go get our fossil. <laughs> I kind of hope so, but I think we might have to go into the underground. Yeah, you, you might have to wait till you get the, uh, the second gym badge. On the verge of a break. Yeah, not, not yet, yet, not, not yet. yet. Okay, yeah. well, we checked. It was worth it. Okay. So now we're two. Up. Now you just go back out. You back out oh, the cave. Oh, that's that's you gotta right. You got to go back to Jubilife, and then you go up. That's right. Oh, do we get encounters today? Uh, you gotta. Oh, thud. <laughs> Whoops, Kate. You got the gym badge, huh? <sighs> Eterna City is the next place with a gym that gives away badges, right? So. Yeah, I went to Route 207, but you can't go through there without a bicycle. Oh, I made my team battle and toughen them up, so it wasn't a waste. So, I'm going back to Jubilife City. Next stop, the Eterna Gym Badge. Ten seconds before I dash. Nine. Bah, who's got time to count? <laughs> <laughs> and we didn't miss any, we got all the encounters we could here, right? Yep. Okay, here we go. Whee! You gotta teach a, a teach a Pokemon Rock Smash. Oh yeah, because in this game it can't be wild Pokemon. Nope, it's not like it's not like how it is in the new one. Oof, I hated that. Well, that's what Bidoof is for, the ultimate HM slave. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Bidoof can learn Rock Smash. Oh bum bum. Okay. All right, Bum Bum. Here we go. Yes. Yep. Bum Bum. Yes. Let's see here. Growl. Growl's gotta go. Goodbye. Bye, Growl. I'm proud of you, Bum Bum. <laughs> Thanks for being the HM slave. Okay, so we have to go, you were saying we have to go up through the cave? Yep. Okay, so I just- Not that cave. Oh. You gotta go back to uh, Jubilee City. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. No, and I know. you go up through that cave where you fought the Mawile. Uh, I don't like that cave. Wasn't there a soul rock in this as well? Mm -hmm. Is that a coincidence or? It was weird. I have no idea. It's random, so. Oh, 
Oh. <sighs> it's this guy again. <laughs> Tell me, have you not obtained a pal pad? No? It's, it's not a pal pad free. <laughs> Is not a pal pad free to anyone visiting the Pokemon Center's basement? Hmm. Anyway, there appears to be no one shady in this Jubilife city. I shall therefore take my investigation elsewhere. But, my friend, I suggest you remain vigilant for shady grown-ups. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Nobody says bye in this. They hey, just bye. walk away. Those aren't shady grown-ups? <laughs> this guy is not a very good... <laughs> not a very good undercover agent. Now... Now, 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 now. That's a lot of nows. <laughs> well, it's, it's like, now, 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 now. Oh. Gotcha. <laughs> Professor Rowan, you must comply. Hand over all your research findings for free, naturally. Failure to comply will result in a painful time for your assistant. Ah, Kate. Well, how is the Pokedex progressing? Hmm. That's Orberg's gym badge, I see. But hadn't I given you your first Pokemon only recently? Perhaps being a trainer is like second nature to you. Ha. Ah. Oh, Professor of Pokemon, must you be so difficult? We are speaking to you on business because this is work for us. What we're saying is we demand you comply with our demands. <laughs> Quiet, you lot. Why must you be such an, a nuisance? Let me list some lessons you still need to learn. 1. Don't loiter about for no good reason. 2. Don't interrupt others while they are attempting to converse. 3. If you don't get your way, you don't raise your voice to be intimidating. Don't think you've grown strong just because you're in a group. What is with those outlandish outfits you have on? <laughs> and that hair. <laughs> My goodness, you call yourselves adults? You kids don't grow up to be like these sorry specimens. <laughs> wow. If you said stuff like that in public, you would be slaughtered. <laughs> ah, you had to make this personal! You have forced our hand into making a show of force. We will make you regret insulting Team Galactic. You kids, give these thugs a lesson in civility, please. <laughs> Kate, join me and battle these guys. Sure. I just got a gym badge, so I'm strong, right? Yep, we don't know what they got. Could be. Okay. Mobile and Totodile. Okay. All right. Well, uh, Totodile kind of scares me with Duck Duck. Well, if you take out Grovile with Ember, possibly Leafeon will outspeed the Totodile and get like a Leaf Blade or something. Helping hand! Woo! One shot KO! That was awesome. Look at that experience. Ah! I am so proud of Duck Duck. MVP caliber status. Is that a good one? It's dark and it never misses. You Smoke really screen is really good, so. Get rid of Lear. Yeah. Okay. Faint attack. Mm -hmm. It could attack the Toto dial. <laughs> yeah, faint attack or smog would be good. What does Lear do? Def mm, I feel like I should get. It's only defense, like. If, uh, I think Totodile only learns special attack water moves, so lowering your defense in this moment. Okay. Well, we'll try this. Leafeon, do something besides helping hand, please. Well, they didn't do helping hand first, so they did too. Hey, green attack will hit a little harder next time. And they didn't even attack you. You're Maybe it doesn't. With this without, you're <laughs> gonna get. Baby's first time, Nuzlocke! <laughs> you're getting away without getting a single hit on you. <laughs> Alright! <laughs> that 
That wasn't hard at all. Nope. This is gonna get really hard, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe it's being very deceptive. <laughs> it's like, we'll be nice in the beginning so that she doesn't try hard and then... Oh, I'm supposed to be reading. Uh, mm, I don't know who's talking, actually. The, oh, okay. The fact they said they something beat good up. about... The <laughs> fact they said something good about Team Galactic... Uh, yeah, it's a good it assumption. Obviously wasn't the, the good guys talking. <laughs> that lot, they call themselves Team Galactic. When Pokemon evolve, they seem to release some type of energy. However, I believe it's a mystic power far beyond our control. But Team Galactic seems to be studying that power's potential. They want to know if it can be used as energy for something. Kate, did you know about this? The professor studies the evolution of Pokemon too. According to his research, 90% of all Pokemon are somehow tied to evolution. Maybe that's the reason those goons tried to take the professor's research data. They're not allowed to do that. It's all over, so you can relax now. Still, thanks to you too, nothing came of that situation. I appreciate that. Incidentally, Kate, kudos to you for your battling skill. It got me thinking, why don't you collect all the gym badges of Sinnoh? I can talk. <laughs> Doing so, you will be sure to encounter lots of Pokemon. That, of course, means your Pokedex pages will continuously fill up. In other words, it will be of great help to my research. That said, I've given you your first Pokemon and Pokedex as yours to keep. You are free to do with them as you wish. Take care. Cool! Hi, random person. Oh, that was very good of you. Nicely done. Truly excellent. Oh, I beg your pardon. I'm from Jubilife TV. I'd like you to have something for letting me see that smashing battle. The fashion case. So I can look fabulous. <laughs> you will find a whole spectrum of chic accessories and tasteful backdrops. Dress up your Pokemon and watch them ap ap their appeal grow. Oh, is this for the fashion or the, the contest stuff? No, it's for the TV stuff. Oh, I didn't play this one. <laughs> and right now, the TV station is offering its facilities so visitors can dress up their Pokemon. There are also prize giveaways, too. Please do visit our TV station. Should I go do that? If you want to, you can. You don't have to. Nah. <laughs> now, we got an encounter here, right? Yep. And we that even fought the, the trainers. The oh, oh. <gasps> Don't show me a Rapidash. Okay, good. I'm just gonna run. This isn't gonna help me get better anyway. It's not gonna help you get good? Nah. Okay. They're too low. All right. Oh. There's an item to the left. Kabuto. Aw, I actually really like Kabuto. This is not a good matchup for right now, though. And I want the item. It's probably just another berry. No. It's so boring. Flash cannon. That's pretty good. TM91. Flash Cannon, isn't that a steel move? Yep, it's steel and special attack. <sighs> I actually knew something. <laughs> Crawdont. I like Crawdont too. All of these Pokemon that I wouldn't put up against. I think I should move Duck Duck. I should put Toots in the front, actually. Toots could get some Because Toots could get some experience, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do that. Yep. Sooner you get Toots to be a... Uh... Oh, actually, Dewdrop needs it. Oh, yeah, Dewdrop is only level 3. Well, Dewdrop still has higher stats than anyone else. That is... Even though Dewdrop is lower level, Dewdrop is still stronger. <laughs> that comes with being a mythic Pokemon. <laughs> oh my gosh, that starter lineup was so broken. <laughs> Alright! What do you have to say for yourself? Are you raising different kinds of Pokemon? If you only have the same type of Pokemon, you'll have a hard time against types it's weak to. That is very true. We're trying to have a diverse team. Oh.
first battle other than the Galactic after the gym. Yan Mega. Oh, yeah. Yan Mega is bug, bug flying. Fly. Yep. I don't know if I have anything really for that. You do not have a very good skill or uh, attack lineup there, Dewdrop. You only have one damaging move. Um, so you know what? We'll switch. So bug flying. Rock is super effective four times against bug flying. See, I feel like this is not only a good learning experience for being able to do Nuzlocke's, but I'm learning about Pokemon. <laughs> Because I usually just play with everything that attacks, go! <laughs> oh, that, that's a double-double team. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Are we going to be able to hit it? Yeah, feign attack, yeah. Feign attack never misses. Okay, should we go Try to... Try one more time with rock throw. Okay. Just see if you can. There you go. Wow. I was like, wow, that setup was... It didn't matter. It absolutely did not matter. Why did you waste a, uh, two rock throws? <laughs> and it dealt one point of damage. And we leveled. Level 16 fast boy. Fast boy for the win. Harden. Uh, I know. I don't think it's worth it, do no, you? No. Yeah, no. Oh, no, I hit the wrong button! No! <laughs> no, I still hit the wrong button! <laughs> I know. <laughs> Slow poke, yes, I will absolutely switch. <laughs> uh, it's only psychic type, it's not psychic water. Is it really? Uh, no, it might be Psychic Water. I'm sorry, I'm th sorry. I'm actually thinking about Psyduck, who's only Water type, and then becomes Psychic Water. Okay, because Psychic... If it is Water type, um, uh, if it is Water type... Littlefoot would do Littlefoot well. Littlefoot would be okay. Okay, well, we'll try it, because I know, I know Psychic is super effective against Grass, isn't it? No. No? No, Psychic is super effective against Poison. Oh, well, well, well. Uh, let's do Razor Leaf. It's so cute! I want a crochet one! <laughs> I love Slowpoke. Well, this is the easiest battle ever. Cool. So guys, we are totally acing this, <laughs> like mega acing this. So since I don't have to focus on it too hard, why don't you post on the comments, down in the comments, what you got for Christmas? Is this a new route? I don't think so. I think it's still the same route you got. Uh, uh hold on. I'm, I'm just gonna- Go in the cave and come back out. Yeah. Yeah, same route. Your next encounter will be in the forest. I just wanted to make sure I don't want to forfeit an encounter. That would that would be the worst, forfeiting an encounter. Yeah. Oh, are you not? Oh. You walked behind me. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> can't see you from behind, silly. Uh, I think I want to make a cup of hot chocolate. That's all I can think about while I play Pokemon. <laughs> all right, fast boy. So yeah, what do you guys get for Christmas? I want to know. I think I'm going to get chocolate. I know what hubby's getting. <laughs> Why are you confused? Oh, I hate it. Didn't matter. It's over. <laughs> My team is like dummy OP right now. Oh yeah. Pinsir. Wow, this was an actual bug trainer with two bug type Pokemon. That's weird. 
This is randomized, I promise. Well, yeah, you can't. I can't un- You can run into Pinsir. I don't think you can run into Venomoth in this gen without getting the national decks. Rock for the guy. Focus energy. Oh. Critical hit. Wow. Well, it used focus energy and fast boy got the crit. Yeah. That was so much experience. 450. Pins are thick. Pins yeah. Are thick. Okay, I think we'll probably do this last battle and then... Isn't this the city right there? Isn't it right there? Oh yeah, that's the next city. Oh yeah, we'll walk yeah, in there and then up. and then we'll end the episode. Cause we're doing it short today. Cause Christmas. <laughs> Hippowdon. Oh, I love Hippowdon. This is actually not bad. No, it's not. Just, uh, we can bubble. I would, I would tail glow then bubble. Tail glow? Huh? Cause I think. Okay. Powdon's got some chonkiness to it. And then just straight up Ember the Ember the, the Rosary. The Rosary. The Rosary. Okay. Ah. <laughs> That's what my tail glow would look like if I had those <laughs> little things on my head. <laughs> Mega Drain. Brutal. <gasps> oh a crit. Um, I would potion and uh, just keep embering with the other one. It's so helpful. Okay. Is will the tail glow still be? Yeah, it just raised the stat. Yeah, so it, yeah, it raises the stat. It, it's not like you have to do something the next turn. Okay. Come on, duck, duck, crit. Ugh. Magical leaf? Magical leaf just never misses. Okay, that wasn't so bad. A crit would be really bad, though. Oh, no. You're gonna be able to beat the Roserade with this next move. Okay. So, like, just bubble the... Oh, a bubble hits both. And, uh... Yeah, Ember Bubble will probably even take out... That was actually kind of sketchy. It didn't. <laughs> It lived on oh, one, HP. one HP. But it's gone now. Yeah. Okay, that scared me more than the hip power dime. Oh yeah. Ooh. Ooh. You pulled it off. That got me nervous. <laughs> uh it's okay, Duck Duck. We're gonna end this now. If you want, you could switch it out and just get some extra experience for somebody that's also weak. Just okay. For throwing them right in the middle of the fight. Let's uh Toots. Toots, toots or Bumbum. Alright, do drop. <laughs> yeah! Yay, we did it. Oh. That definitely made me nervous for a moment. <laughs> well that that crit mega drain was crazy. Oh. Okay, um... You should have an item on that side. Yes! Silverwind. Oh, no, another, another TM. TM. I need to check out these TMs before the next episode and see if I can't teach them to anybody. Oh, Sceptile. What's That's up, pretty... Sceptile? That's awesome. That would have been cool to have. Yeah. This is not a good matchup right now, though. It no pursuit. Even if we run? No, run doesn't do anything. Okay. Okay. It's only if you switch out. Okay. So running was better. Yeah. And we made it! Woohoo! I love this town. This town brings me so much happiness. All right. I'm going to heal and then we're going to say goodbye. This went a little longer than I anticipated, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, you guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, make sure you leave a uh, like by tickling and poking the like button. Only do it once though, because otherwise it doesn't work. <laughs> and then subscribe to join our family if you haven't already. 
Our family is growing so fast. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. You guys have been knocking it out of the park. I did not expect to be here by Christmas. My goal was to have 100 by Christmas and we've already surpassed that and Christmas is today. <laughs> but I, I'm obviously recording this before Christmas. But Merry Christmas. Kiba says Merry Christmas. Right, baby? Say Merry Christmas. Awoo. <laughs> I care not for your whims, mother. <laughs> And happy holidays if you don't celebrate Christmas. I hope that no matter what, you're surrounded by love and family and friends and good food and good stories and fun times. Thanks again for watching. I love you guys and I will see you tomorrow for more Pokemon Nuzlocke. Bye! Bye-bye!